With Kindful Causes, donors can create their own fundraising pages and invite their friends to give, creating a networking web of fundraisers and donors in support of your organization. Let's see how to create a cause. In Kindful, select Causes on the left sidebar. This will show you a list of your current causes with options to view and edit them. Next, we'll select Add New Cause on the right. There are six parts to this process and they're all pretty straightforward. Let's start with the summary. I'll give my cause a name and a URL path. Remember, any Kindful donation page you use is always your organization name .kindful.com. So this URL path will be added onto the end of that. I'll make mine Turtle Swim, which makes the entire URL path cturtles.kindful.com slash turtle swim. Give your cause a description and any notes. The description will show on the main cause page, while the notes will only show on your Kindful account. Choose which campaign all the gifts will funnel into, and choose if you want to cap the number of teams or the number of people per team. You'll probably use this feature if you have an event associated with this cause, where you only have a limited amount of space available, like a running event. I'll set a start and finish date, and set the event date. It's recommended to have the event date be sooner than the finish date, so teams and team members can look at the page after the deadline and see how the goal was met. There are a few other options, but the last one you need to enter is at the bottom, declaring the overall goal and if you want that goal displayed on the cause page. The Abilities tab has a few allowances for team members, and most people leave these options checked. Messaging allows you to give direction on some wording for your cause. I'm going to change my cause's verbiage to say swimmers instead of team, and support a swimmer. I'll check this box so others can create their own cause page. When a team member creates their own cause page, I can give some instructions here. Finally, if I have more instructions, like an orientation video, I can put that link here. The next tab sets some defaults for my teams. I can give a default goal and leave that locked in, or give teams the option to set it themselves. Typically, teams will choose their own team quote and about section, but I can give some default filler text, shortening the process for some who won't want to fill that in. There are a few things to customize, like the page color and donate wording. Finally, I can give some sample text for supporters to easily start sharing. I have three text options when my cause is shared, and a few text options when a team is shared. Lastly, I'll make sure the checkbox in the lower left is set to visible if I want the cause to be live right now, and then I'll save my cause. A quick look at the cause section in Kindful shows the cause I just created. If I need to change any of the settings I just went through, I can always select edit on the right. The next step is to invite team members to start fundraising. Learn how in the next video.